Okay, I'm Chris Lewis Jones. I'm a, a live artist and fine artist based in Nottingham. And I've always been interested in abstract expressionism and gestural abstraction, the passion of it all, which is why we thought we might do something to coincide with Valentine's Day. Because despite his crabby exterior and the extent to which Pollock himself was socially challenged, emotionally challenged, he was deeply romantic, and I think it's difficult for artists not to be interested in the romantic spirit. What's the difference between uh, working with Perspex and, say, Canvas, which, which Pollock would have used? He would, and I like Perspex because you're less in control of the medium than, than one would be on Canvas. Because the first mark that you make on a transparent material like this is the, uh, the top mark, the, the mark that will define the form. So it's, uh, I think it's more challenging than working on Canvas. So, how do you know it's finished? Well, that's a difficult one, Alan. And I think it goes back to what I was talking about earlier, and that's a, a real appraisal of modernism. Because I suppose modernists believed in the, uh, the apprenticeship system. You did your homework, and you became a master of your own form of visual language. And it's, it was assumed that um, people who went to art school, people who practiced, would know enough about color, composition, texture, line, to know when a piece was, was complete. And I think I'm sufficiently old fashioned to think that, you know, you, some people do have a good eye. And I'd like to think my eye is good enough to tell me that that's finished at this particular point. So what you're saying is this experience tells you it's finished. Indeed, it's experience. There's a lot to be said for it.